Welcome to the home show. This display we have here is a culmination of work from Alu Interiors and also Urban Kitchens and Joinery. Let me take you on a tour of the display. So fo follow me through into our kitchen. We have first and foremost a lovely bench top here. So this is a silver galaxy marble. We've gone for a 30 mil thickness, which is really accentuated over this three meter long island bench top. With our cabinetry, we've done a, a two pack finish, but what you'll notice when you get closer is it's actually a matte. So you're not getting fingerprints like you would traditionally with a two pack option. Um, the other nice little addition on the back side of this cabinet is our solid timber spotted gum. So we're not using a veneer, we're using a really nice solid timber. Gives a really good tangible feel and a texture. As we go through, obviously we have our nice, this is from Fisher and Paykel. Uh, this is a brand new finish. So they've gone with an anthracite brushed metal, which is quite interesting. Um, and we've got obviously some very nice Siemens ovens. So we've got a steamer and a normal pyrolithic oven. We also have a few little trick things in here today. So there's a company that we use for all of our hardware items. So they're called Bloom. Um, they have automated systems as well as drawer runners and hinges. With the, with the type of runner system that we utilize, it's a full extension drawer runner with a built-in soft close. This takes the crash and bang out of each motion. The other nice little addition that we've done is we've carried that same textured timber. So this is a solid timber inlay in our, in our drawers. In, in combination, we've done a custom sculpt uh, handle detail with a 25 millimeter thick draw front. So traditionally, when we're talking about cabinetry, the thickness is usually only 16 or 18 millimeters. By increasing the board thickness, we give ourselves a much better perch with our fingers. As we, as we follow through the kitchen, we have on the back bench, this is a man-made stone. Uh, it comes from a company called Quantum Quartz, and it's made to look like a natural marble. This in combination with a solid uh, granite composite sink reduces the amount of stainless steel, plus doesn't have the issues that would notoriously come with it. So no scratching and things, which is really nice. Uh, we also have in here a couple little tricky items. So we have our integrated bin drawer system. We have drawers underneath our sink and a fully integrated dishwasher. So when we talk about ergonomics for a kitchen, we often talk about a production line. So we want to scrape into our bin, rinse in our sink and pop into our dishwasher. We then look to our next closest set of drawers for all of our plates, crockery, cutlery, knives and forks. And this is really part of the, the ergonomics that we, we discuss as part of the design process. Let me also take you over to our bathroom display. So we have quite a few interesting and custom options as part of this. The first and foremost is our Victoria Albert bath. So this, this is a combination of a custom paint job, which we've done in a copper finish. This, is, this has been accented throughout the design of this space. So we've done the accents on our tapware, shower rose, in-wall system, and also a little inlay in our cabinetry. So when we think about our design process, we're all about integrating each theme into the design to get a really good continuity. The other interesting component we have here is a man-made stone. So this is Caesar stone. Uh, this is a brand new color called rugged concrete. It's made to look and feel like natural concrete, but with inherent good, good non-porous qualities that we come to know and love from our man-made stone. We've also done what we call a washboard uh, basin. So this is a custom insert can be any size, that's up to the design. But the advantage being, we can, we can make this to suit and there's no silicon join. So it's a lot more hygienic than what you'd normally get from a, a standard basin that maybe undermounts into the, into the bench top. The other unique features that we have are a custom drawer front. So this is a, an American oak veneer, which has got an aggravated surface, which shows this texture through the board. The other very interesting thing is it's got painted with a very, very special two-pack paint, which is 2% VOC. So it's very ecologically sustainable in its painting process. Um, and the other nice little advantage of this is it can be done in almost any color. So we can color match any Dulux house paint color and also customize the gloss level at the same time. With our mirror cabinet, we've got a custom LED strip lighting, 
and this positions the lighting towards your face from all different directions. We also have concealed inside this cabinet a very clever little unique storage item. So this is recessed into the wall and gives it a lot of above bench storage space which is very accessible at eye level. We also have our tiles here. So this, these come from a company just uh, in Brisbane called Classic Ceramics. These are called Up. They project out from the wall. So in combination with our LED strip lighting, that really enhances the effect of the tile and shows us the different undulated surfaces. This comes in four different colors um, and also quite a few different patterns as well. So I hope you've enjoyed my little run through of our display today. And thank you for coming to the home show.